Assalamu alaikum everyone welcome back to PHP tutorials today is our lecture number 5 and in today's lecture I am going to demonstrate what are uh, HTTP environment variables inside PHP okay so basically these are the variables that gives you some uh, unique information regarding your servers regarding your protocols regarding your ports and regarding your browsers and all that so uh, if you wanted to access the information from your request uh, that is appearing so you can use these environment variables in order to get the browser detail in order to get the protocol detail in order to get the uh, server which you are using in order to get the version number of the php in order to get the uh, version number of the apache and and all the all these things that you wanted to manage then uh, you use this in, uh, environment variables okay so let me show you how you can use it's very simple let's start all right guys so uh, i have already uh, written on notepad these some uh, uh, environment variables that helps you to extract some information so let's talk about first the server software server software is a environment variable that helps you to uh, retrieve the information related to your server the server on which your application is executing okay so you'll get the information uh, related to your server so how can you access this so just copy this code and just go to your dreamweaver and just paste it here simple just echo it if you are echoing it you can use it for other purposes as or uh, as well so let us see what's the result look so i'm using apache and the, the version of the apache is 2.4 and then uh, it's open ssl version is 1.1 and then uh, the php that i'm using is 7.2.1 i hope it is clear to everyone so based on this simple uh, environment variable you can be able to access the information now uh, the next thing uh, let me add a br tag save it and now the next variable that I'm going to use is paste it and then simply remove this and select your next one that is name so if I wanted to access the name of my server then look what will happen save it and then come here and then refresh it look localhost because I'm running it on my computer locally and Apache server is running there and let us see the third one that's the server protocol so if you use this what will happen let let me show you copy this code and then paste it below and then simple right here server underscore protocol simple and save it and then go to your browser again and refresh it look because we are using for communication the http protocol that is 1.1 version and then the last thing is the server port that means the port number that is that you are using for communication so let us uh, copy once again and paste it here and write here port so guys look uh, based on these variables we can be able to access the information regarding our uh, things that we are the technologies that we are using look the port number is 82 that i am using i hope it is clear to everyone so from now onwards if you are uh, fine if you have having difficulty in finding the ports and the servers and the and all the things you can find it from these also okay okay one more i must mention here is echo uh, first uh, apply the br and uh, in fact copy this and then paste it here and then uh, specify here http underscore user underscore agent so save it and see what what will it display look it is representing me what type of browser it can support okay the request the request that is coming uh, on this page and now uh, all right so uh, one more i wanted to tell you that is um, these all are the environment variables and if you write here http underscore accept so it will display you all the information that what is this uh, protocol accepting so save it and then execute it on chrome so look it can accept this it can accept this and it can accept these all and all these so these are all the things that are coming within the request when you send some request on the server and the response is coming back so this is what is within the request we have okay so hopefully you have understood uh, the today's lecture that what are the environment variables if you do not understand anything please do write me thank you so much take care allah hafiz